What's going on YouTube? It's your boy V Faded Man. In today's video, we got three boxes of heat to talk about, you guys. Three, man. Three. You get what I'm saying? Two of these are definitely fire releases, and the third one, it's a release that people I feel like slept on. It was buzzing, you know what I'm saying? But listen, we ain't gonna get too much into that right now. Let's get into this intro. First you gotta find your passion, then you stick with it. One thing about this game, you gotta stay consistent. Okay, you guys, we are back, man, after that beautiful intro, man. If you haven't already, man, make sure you like, comment, and subscribe to my channel, man. I would greatly appreciate it, man. And spam that thumbs up, man. You get what I'm saying? Do that for your boy one time. But like I said, we got three boxes of heat to talk about, you guys. First box is going to be somewhat mediocre to you guys, but it's something that I grab because, listen, they be fire. They be fire, man. Just plain and simple. They be fire, man. But let's get into that shoe real quick. Got to dig into this stack real quick. We definitely gonna show these last. Ugh. We gonna grab this right here. And we gonna bring this up. If you guys own a pair of these, you know what this box is already, you guys. This is a New Balance box right here, you guys. Beautiful shoe, that, that might I add, you know what I'm saying? Y'all see what's going on with the tag. And also very affordable, you guys. So let me show you what's inside. So listen, I picked these up, man. I was very excited to get these due to the fact that something else was dropping that day. Uh, not even that day, like that, that, that week. So I had to grab these. But these are fire though, y'all. Very fire, very affordable. You know what I mean? And as of right now, I feel like they're slept on. But listen, let me show you these joints. We got your UNC New Balance 550s, you guys. This is a beautiful silhouette right here, you guys. It's not your average New Balance. I'm sure you guys all seen them, you guys. You know what the, listen, you can do so much with this shoe, man. So much with this shoe, just for the simple fact that it's not a regular New Balance. You get what I'm saying? Now, it's a lot of New Balance that people rocking with. You get what I'm saying? And, and they, listen, they dropping some quality, man. But listen, these retail 120. You know what I'm saying? 120, why not? You know what I mean? We paid 225 for Jordans. Why not grab a silhouette like this? And like I said, it's a UNC colorway. You guys know what dropped the same week that these dropped. If you do not know, we're about to get into that shoe next. Beautiful colorway, you guys. Y'all see that blue hidden off of there, man. Look at that blue. Look at that white. And look at that gray right there. That new bug material on the, on the toe right there, man. Beautiful, man. And the sole is just unique as well within itself. It gives me an old school 80s vibe feel. You get what I'm saying? Fire, man. I love this shoe, man. Love this shoe. Very comfortable they are narrow so if you do have like a wide foot you might want to go a size up just to just so just for the comfort you get what i'm saying fire no lace swap for these joints i wish they did have a blue but i ordered some blue laces uh the same university blue that's on the bottom of these uh unc blue i'm going to swap the laces and put those in there but that's going to be fire man listen this is a fire shoe man 120 you can't beat it go grab these if you can man i'm sure they're at your local dtlr hibbit sports tap into them man also on footlocker.com they have a plethora of these on there, man for a great affordable price man make sure you go grab those joints now for this next shoe that we about to get into this shoe came out the same exact week those dropped you guys and you know what this is about already y'all know what these about already man i'm sure y'all seen them already on the on plethora of channels you know what i'm saying many of channels shout out to all those guys that get those shoes early but listen we about retail over here i'm not even gonna cap unless it's something i have to grab which we gonna get into something like that pretty soon these babies are fire. I'm only gonna take one out, not even gonna take both out. This shoe is mad fire. Let me drop that right there. Y'all see what's going on. Y'all see what's going on, man. I have all the UNC's, only UNC, well, what UNC's don't I have? I have the UNC ones, I got the sixes, I got the threes. I got anything this color blue, I got 13s. what I say, sixes, ones, threes. Listen, we got, we got a whole bunch of shit over here that's blue, I'm not even gonna cap to you whole bunch of listen we got them you know what i'm saying this shoe right here is mad fire man look at that shoe man the material on this shoe now this appears to be regular new bug but it's not it's like a smooth it's a smooth ass new bug material man beautiful smooth new bug material now the inside is what grabbed my attention as you guys can see you see a satin material in the inside as well as your 3m tongue right there on the front gray and look at that lace lock right there y'all see that blue lace lock fire i have yet to undes these y'all i will probably not for quite some time you know what i mean we can't forget the white and the blue speckles right there on the side look at that beautiful but we're gonna get into the bottom boom look at that fire you got your icy blue bottom 
bottom. Actually, this ain't even, I wouldn't even call this, is it like a blue? It is like an ice blue. Definitely an ice blue bottom. You got your jump man up under there as well. You know what I'm saying? Classic Jordan uh, bottom. Definitely a fire shoe, you know what I'm saying? And then we go to the back tab. Boom. Same back tab that's on the threes. I mean, on the sixes, fire. You know what I'm saying? Definitely need to grab this shoe, man. Very good quality shoe, well put together, man. Listen, you can't, I can't thank Jordan enough, man. The creativity, the, the materials they use, and man, they definitely bringing back quality to the shoes, you guys. Just be patient, man. They got, it's a lot of stuff coming. You get what I'm saying? It's a lot of stuff coming, man. Like I said, the quality of the shoe is mad beautiful, man. They definitely put some thought into the shoe. Yeah, it may be all blue, but once you get the hand, the foot, the shoe in your hand, they actually look at the detail on the shoe. Wow, mad fire. Can't go wrong with that. You know what I'm saying? We're gonna put that baby down. This shoe right here, we are all about retail. But listen, your boy had to, I had to scratch that itch. You know what I'm saying? I had to scratch that itch today. And we got something over here. We got something over here, man. We got something over here. And if you guys don't know what's coming out this weekend, now you know. Now, like I said, I'm sure you've seen these shoes already on YouTube, you guys. But listen, this is my channel. And we got them now. You know what I'm saying? So we about to look at these babies now. As you guys can see, you got your age box right here as well. Let me see. Where the size tab at? Boom, on this side. Y'all see what's going on. I do like how they making the Jordan 3 tops much uh, longer right here to go all the way halfway over to cover basically the whole entire top of the shoe. It gives me a Jordan 6 uh, Jordan box vibe, you know what I'm saying? But this this is definitely one of those right here, y'all. One of those for sure. This was a must have, must grab. You guys see the inside of the box. You got your age cracks around the edges of the shoe box. Also on the outside, man. Beautiful box. They definitely did what they were supposed to do, but really, all they did was make it look aged. You know what I'm saying? It's a cool box, though. We're going to take that. Inside, you have your Jordan card. Now, people, listen. If you do not get this Jordan card inside of the box, the shoe is not authentic. Do you understand what I'm saying to you? The shoe is not authentic if you don't get this in the inside, you guys. And I've been seeing a lot of people trying to sell these. Oh, I don't have the card in the inside. Then it's a knockoff. You get what I'm saying? And we ain't doing those, man. Straight authenticity over here, man. This is what we got right here. You guys see this card? It got all that good jazz in the inside, how the shoe was made, how they put it together. The year it came out, all that good jazz. We're going to sit that down right over here, man, because we definitely don't want to damage that or lose that because Jordan don't give us Jordan cards anymore, which I, I hope they do get back to that, man. That Jordan card was a classic, and it gave people uh, uh, something to look forward to. You know what I'm saying? You may see a Jordan 1 all the way through 15 on there. You want, you want, you want to pick each one. You know what I'm saying? You want to try to get your hands on each one. That's how I started collecting shoes, just seeing that card and saying, okay, I'm gonna try to get these. I'm gonna try to get these. I'm gonna try to get these. You get know what I'm saying? Just took my time and definitely went with that. But listen, these babies right here, I'm not gonna lie. They say this the shoe of the year. <sighs> this baby is clean. You get know what I'm saying? This baby is clean. The inside, you got your uh, elephant print paper. You know what I mean? Gray. Nothing really special about it, man, but we gonna pull these babies out and we gonna get into these. Oh my God, damn, these babies look good. These babies look good. Now, I have been seeing a lot of crazy stuff, man. I'm not even gonna cap. I had to have dude go give me like three uh, three different boxes of these joints, man, because I wasn't having it. I wasn't having it. I needed my shoe to look identical as possible. You know what I'm saying? I wasn't playing no games. These babies are mad fire, man. You reimagined Jordan 3s, man. We definitely got them in hand today. Beautiful, man. I did not hit on sneakers. I wasn't blessed enough, man. My brother called me like 10 minutes like literally like i can't even say 10 minutes maybe like four minutes into that uh shock drop definitely couldn't hit from him hibbit and everybody else will be releasing paris tomorrow if you enter the raffle man let's i'm praying for you guys i'm praying for you this will be a very hard shoe to get all the resellers on the uh, streets are already selling them for 300 you guys selling them for 300 for resellers and if you buy after buy them out of the aftermarket store they are selling them for 400 dollars. you guys if you do have them early and you try to sell them they won't pay anything over 280 to 300 you guys so don't jip yourself just sit on them until next summer and these babies will be hot trust me now these shoes speak for itself man it ain't too much i can really say you know what i'm saying y'all y'all see these babies right here man beautiful you see your orange hang tab might i add it's pretty thin you know what i mean but hey and this little wiry piece right here i don't like that because what if i wanted to leave this on and y'all gave us this wiry ass hang tag like what's up with that why y'all ain't give us you know what i mean the little silver the little silver john that go on there man i don't really like that that was a that was a cheap add-on right there but listen we'll take it um you see the elephant print on here really well man that elephant print looks really 
fucking good. And as you guys can see as well, you guys, I've been seeing a lot of fakes out there. The toe box is flat on these joints, you guys. And the elephant print is raised higher. And we also have a widow's peak right there on the tip of that shoe, man. Don't get it twisted out here, you guys. Make sure you pay attention to your shoe, man, so you know exactly what's going on. We're going to flip it to the back. And as you can see, you got your cream Nike tab back there, man. Black Nike cream on the back. Beautiful. Y'all see the height is all perfect. The inside, perfect. Y'all see the red guts. Uh, look at that. Red guts in the inside, man. You can't go wrong with that shoe. Red jump man on the tongue. Uh, <coughs> excuse him. Why? Red jump man on the tongue, man. Beautiful shoe, man. Listen. This shoe, man. Is it the shoe of the year? I don't know. Because your boy is waiting on something else, man. I'm waiting on some other shoes. I definitely had to get my hands on these. I was not going to miss this shoe. I never actually had this shoe. I got the... Uh, I got the black cements, I got the fire reds, you know what I mean, I got tinkers. I've never had my hands on the uh, original joint like this, but I definitely wanted this one. You know what I'm saying? It's reimagined, but it's definitely the closest name we're going to get to original. Only thing different is the age mid, so which is cream, and it's not half bad. This shoe is mad fire, man. Definitely worth the grab. And if you can, man, double up on these joints. That is my plan. I did enter those raffles, so hopefully your boy hit. You know what I'm saying? I did go to finish line today, and the raffle that they did was kind of weird. They did do exclusive access on the app. They got you scanning the code up at the mall in beachwood ohio so fingers crossed for those i hope i do hit for retail that way i can double up i do have another pair on hold as well but that pair is pretty pricey you know what i'm saying shout out to my guy larry it's not really pricey it's 300 dollars. you know what i'm saying it's, the shoe is 225 retail so or 210 retail one of them two so listen i'm happy i got these joints man i will be trying to double up on those just as well as i did the uh reimagined jordan ones you definitely want to double up on those joints because like i said these babies will be hot come summertime y'all know when the shoe drops the shoe is low right now on stock x this shoe in the 10 and a half is only 301 after tax it's like maybe three like three and some change man not that bad not that bad you know what i'm saying like i said reseller retail st uh, reseller stores are selling these babies for 350 dollars, man so listen just wait if you if you have to man try to talk them down to at least 325 or 300 you get what i'm saying if you can if you got that mouthpiece and you got that sauce you know what i'm saying you got that face card do what you got to do because i know people will be like man how you do this how you do that listen my face card ring bells I'm, I'm a good guy good relationships man build relationships with people you'll they'll definitely look out for you man and my guy held these for me and told me listen you got them same thing with the fives i got those early but i did not make a video man i've been busy up at the shop y'all your boy got his own shop in cleveland ohio and cleveland heights y'all so if y'all ever in the city of cleveland come see your boy v faded i will get you put together man but listen Jordan is dropping nothing but gems on us, man. We do have some more heat coming back out. You know what I mean? Re-releasing, and I'm actually happy about, you know what I mean? I, keep it a buck. I'm happy about those Laney 14s, man. I actually have that pair. I've been trying to dig and find them. I think I have them in the attic, man. But I had that pair from when it first dropped, you guys. And listen, I'm extremely ecstatic about that shoe. That is a shoe that I will double up on personally. The Laney 14 is mad fire. I love 14s, you know what I mean? Used to hoop in them. Uh, very comfortable shoe, very light shoe, man. And just that colorway, the blue, the black, the yellow with the with the metallic fangs on the side like listen you can't go wrong with that man that is a beautiful sneaker man we will be touching on those man but today's video was about these universities and that jordan 3 reimagine make sure you put your bids in man tomorrow raffles do drop man so hopefully you guys that are subscribed to my channel you hit for those joints matter of fact let's get another look at that real quick let's look at another look at those man Hopefully you hit for these joints, man. Go grab them if you do hit. And if you don't, if you didn't get these, man, go grab these. These are definitely worth the grab. I know a lot of people don't like Jordan 5s or Jordan 6s, man. But listen, this is definitely worth the grab. Mad fire, man. Mad fire shoe. Very good quality shoe. Something to put up. I will be doubling up on these pretty soon before the price goes up crazy. And like I said, you want to build your sneaker collection, y'all? <laughs> Listen, 110 to 120 dollars, man. Don't go wrong with these joints. Mad fire. Look at that, man. Look at that shoe. That's a beautiful shoe, man. You can't go wrong with these, man. Build your collection. 550s are mad fire. You get what I'm saying? Mad fire. You can do a lot with these, man. You can wear floods. You can wear sweatpants, jean jacket, baggy pants. Whatever you want to do, you can swag this joint. You get what I'm saying? You can beat them up. They're very sturdy. Very sturdy shoe. You know what I mean? It's not super heavy, but it's not super light as well. You know what I'm saying? Mad fire shoe, man. 
man. Make sure you do your due diligence out here. Do your research, man. Like I said, Foot Locker, Finish Line, you guys, online, they have a plethora of these. Red and black, cream and brown, brown and white. You know what I mean? Black and white, all white, all blue. Listen, they got these. Blue and yellow. They got, listen, they got them, man. Go get these babies, man. Affordable. Build your collection, man. And when you build a collection, it's not all about just having Jordans. You got to have other shoes inside of those, man. But unfortunately, you know what I mean? Or fortunately, I will say fortunately, Jordan drops every damn Saturday. You know what I'm saying? It's always something dropping. So listen, if you can't afford the Jordan at that time, man, go grab you something else and just continue to stack on to your collection, man. It's your boy V Faded, man. I ain't think we can make it this far, man. We made it out the mud. We out. First you gotta find your passion, then you stick with it. One thing about this game, you gotta stay consistent.